HP Stream 11. The HP Stream 11 is a cute little thing. It comes in two versions, Horizon Blue and Orchid Magenta. Dash. Our review sample came in the former color scheme. It stands out and in a good way, the child in me rather likes the bold, friendly blue design. The plastic itself is soft to the touch, and any sweaty marks it picks up from clammy fingers fade away in seconds. An HP logo cut from a piece of shiny silver metal sits in the center of the lid, while four rubber feet sit on the bottom and stop the PC from sliding around on tabletops. It lacks the elegance of something like the Lenovo ThinkPad X1 Carbon 2015 or MacBook Air, but the stream is fun and visually pleasing. Too many budget laptops come wrapped up in dull silver or gray, a bit of variety is a very welcome change. What you'll find when you open the HP Stream 11 up is less attractive. The bezels on all sides of the screen are large and the base unit is clad in a two-tone, PowerPoint-style gradient effect. The top face of the keyboard dock closest to the screen is the same blue as the rest of the PC, but the side closest to the trackpad is turquoise. It looks snap, and is reminiscent of FC Barcelona's ugly 2012-13 away kit. What's more, it's dotted in a load of small, silver spots. What inspired this look is beyond us, because it's not great. In this position, it's apparent that build quality isn't sublime. The plastic frame that surrounds the keyboard element is sharp and not quite flush with the top of the base. It felt rough on our palms and wrists when we typed and produced a scratchy sound whenever we rubbed against it. We also noticed that lots of flecks of dust got caught in the little gap between the frame and body almost immediately. The screen element feels a little flimsy, and is easy to bend with your fingers. The hinge also allows you to force the screen several degrees further back than it should go, which isn't reassuring. That said, the design and build quality is still above average for a laptop this price. While it's light, at 1.28 kg, it feels a little heavier than it is. That's due to the fact that it's essentially an 11-inch laptop in the body of a 13-incher. The 11-inch MacBook Air is significantly lighter, at 1.08 kg, but it also costs several times as much as the Stream 11. We found it fairly comfortable to balance on one hand while typing with the other for a few minutes at a time. For the price, we have no complaints. You won't have any problems carrying the stream around with you, either. It's only 19.7mm thick and at 300mm wide, it'll fit comfortably into any rucksack or messenger bag. Just make sure you don't stick it in the same compartment as your house keys, because the plastic body is prone to picking up scratches. A strong selection of ports is available on the base. USB 2.0 USB 3.0 and HDMI slots sit on the right side, while the charging port, SD card slot and Kensington security lock are on the left. Vitally, any SD card you use doesn't stick out at all. This means you can expand the limited 32GB built-in storage without inconvenience.